Good evening. Good evening. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm Marcelo Viana, the current director of IMPA, and I want to welcome you all to this meeting, uh, first joint meeting of Brazilian and Italian mathematics. I'm going to go. Well, I was just told I'm the master of ceremonies for this uh, opening event, so I will first call the colleagues who are going to uh, join me here at the stage. We are honored to have the presence of the Council, Council of uh, Italy in Rio de Janeiro. We are very happy and very proud that you accepted to join us. Please come, Mr. Riccardo Battisti. Uh, I will call Maria José Pacifico, the uh, chair of the local organizing committee. <laughs> Professor Ciro Ciliberto, president of the uh, Italian Mathematical Union. <laughs> Geraldo Silva, who is representing the president of the uh, Brazilian Society for Applied and, and Computational Mathematics. Jacob Palis, president of the uh, uh, Brazilian Academy of Sciences, former president of the Brazilian Academy of Sciences and <laughs> former director of IMPA. And um, I, don't, I don't see me who's to blame for this meeting. Ah, and Paulo Piccioni, uh, representing the uh, president of the Brazilian Mathematical Society. Okay, let us sit, sit. So I'm, I'm uh, particularly happy uh, to see this audience here today, basically filling in this auditorium, uh, in part because uh, I was once working very uh, intensely in my office and I got an email from Aaron Simis, who was visiting <coughs> Ciro Ciliberto in Italy and had just an idea that maybe we could have a joint meeting of uh, Brazilian and Italian mathematics. Since I was, uh, at the time, the president of the Brazilian Mathematical Society, he thought he would share the, uh, this idea with me. And I'm pretty sure they were not expecting an answer within five minutes, which is what they, they got. I responded immediately and absolutely emphatically that we ought to do it. And. Uh, <coughs> Well, there's a saying in, in Brazilian, no good deed will go unpunished. So uh, they had this bright idea, him and, and Chiro together, so they, uh, I immediately suggested that they should chair the, uh, jointly the uh, scientific committee. And then, of course, we worked on <coughs> putting the four uh, mathematical societies of the two countries together, uh, the Brazilian uh, math, math society and the... Uh, Society for Applied and Mathematical Compu uh, and, and, uh, Computational Mathematics and their counterparts on the Italian side. They appointed the uh, scientific committee and whatever is uh, going well, and I, I'm hearing lots of compliments on the program, it's really the, uh, <coughs> the merit of the scientific committee work very hard to not only to um, put together this program but also to encourage uh, submission of proposals for special sessions on which this event is particularly successful. Um, <clears throat> at the same time, I have to uh, say a special word about Maria José Pacific, who was really the heroine of the uh, practical matters for organizing this, this meeting. At some point, there was a panic that the meeting was getting much bigger than expected, and uh, so I was called to to see how much uh, space and so on IMPA could offer. I think we managed to accommodate all the needs of the meeting and uh, of course there was a lot of work going behind that I think uh, Zeze, as we call her, is, is, uh, should be praised for. I don't want to <coughs> extend too much. I will give uh, pass the word to the other members of this uh, podium. But uh, I just want to welcome you to, to Rio. Uh, for those of you who are visiting IMPA for the first time, 
as a particular word of, of welcoming. This is a special moment for Brazilian mathematics because we are, as most of you certainly know, uh, involved in, in organizing the next International Congress of Mathematicians in two years from now. In a year from now, we will be having here in Rio for the first time the International Mathematical Olympia. And we, we are turning this, uh, these circumstances into a pretext to, uh, for a big, a very ambitious project for popularizing mathematics that is called Biennium of Mathematics 2017-2018, an initiative that we are building now with the support of the Brazilian National Parliament who has, uh, is about to proclaim officially that those two years will be dedicated to mathematics. So this is a particularly interesting period here and I hope you will enjoy your stay at IMPA, uh, that you will enjoy a little bit of Rio and, um, and have fun. Thank you very much. So now I'll pass the microphone to Mr. Battisti, the Council of Italy in, in Rio, for a welcoming address. Okay, thank you very much and uh, good night to everybody. I was not prepared to talk, but I will say a few words with pleasure. I am sincerely proud and happy to be here because this is something that uh, it is not so common to, to, to see. and. Uh, I think that there is a big effort uh, behind all this uh, to organize a congress like uh, this one. Uh, being uh, the Italian general consul in Rio de Janeiro, I am really happy to, to be here with uh, professors coming from uh, uh, the Brazilian uh, society and uh, the Italian uh, one. So I hope that this congress will have uh, as I think uh, the best uh, success uh, possible. And uh, I give uh, the microphone back to our host. Thank you very much. Okay, on behalf of the Brazilian Mathematical Society, the SBM, I would like to welcome all participants of the first joint meeting Brazil-Italy in Mathematics. Welcome to Brazil, welcome to Rio de Janeiro, the wonderful city, da Cidade Maravilhosa, and welcome to IMPA, the Instituto, Nacional, the Instituto de Matemática Pura Aplicada, which is one of the excellent centers of mathematics in the country, among others. As we can read in the home page of the event, the meeting has the goals to promote acquaintance and scientific collaborations between Brazilian and Italian mathematicians and explore opportunities to build partnerships among Brazilian and Italian academic and scientific institutions. And this include the Unione Matematica Italiana, the Sociedade Brasileira de Matematica, Sociedade Brasileira de Matematica Aplicada e Computacional, and the Società Italiana Matematica, di Matematica Applicata Industriale. As a matter of fact, Brazilian and Italian mathematics already have a solid historic background of joint research developed by collaborating groups, including areas like probability analysis, differential equations, algebraic and differential geometry, algebra, applied mathematics, and possibly many others. Uh, when the scientific committee opened the submission of proposals of special sessions, we were literally overwhelmed with the huge number of submissions presented in all possible areas. And this is a clear indication that the seeds of mathematical cooperation are planted on a fertile ground. So let me say that the goal of our mathematical societies is to take advantage of this ground to build a solid scientific bridge between the two countries. From a Brazilian perspective, let me also say that we are very happy that our academic institutions have received in the last decade an increasing number of young and talented mathematical researchers from Italy, many of whom have decided to pursue their academic career in this country. This is another strong indication that mathematical cooperation between our countries is expected to increase in the future and that possibly we will have many more joint meetings like this in the next years. 
But before thinking of next meetings, let me thank those people who made this meeting a reality. We thank, thankfully acknowledge the great work of the scientific committee, of our Brazilian sponsors like the CNPQ, which is the Ministry of Science, Technology and Innovation, the CAPES, which is the Ministry of Education, and the IMPA, and FAPEG, which is the um, Secretary uh, of Science, Technology and Innovation of the State of Rio de Janeiro. Then let me also thank the session organizers, the plenary speakers, as well as the speakers of all special sessions, and the staff at IMPA. Very special thanks also go to the organizing committee, and especially to Maria José Pacifico, Zezé, who has done an outstanding job during the entire organization of the meeting. We also thank all participants, and we encourage all of you to give your contribution to the success of this fantastic event. We wish to each of you a great mathematical week, hoping that you can also take advantage of the many opportunities that this institute and this city offer to its visitors. Thank you. So, oh, good night, I think now. Good night for everyone. First of all, I'd like to welcome um, all the participants to this meeting um, on behalf of the Society for, uh, Brazilian Society for Computation and Applied Mathematics. I'm here uh, representing Antonio José da Silva Neto, who is the president of the Society, but she, he could not come here, so um, I, 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 I am uh, speaking on, on, on his behalf, but um, he didn't send me um, his speech, so I'm going to improvise myself. So. <laughs> well, as I told you, it is really a pleasure for me. I'm very formal, so I just, um, <laughs> I just want to tell that um, when this uh, meeting was uh, proposed, uh, as uh, Marcelo Viana told, um, I, I was contacted by Marcelo Viana to see if SBMAC wanted to, be, to take part in this um, in this event, and I, and I said, SBMAC would would do that. Would do that. I was um, leaving the presidency of, of SBMAC at that time, and Antonio Silvanet took over, uh, and I was uh, assigned by SBMAC to be to take part in the orga in the organizing committee, you no, know, in the scientific committee of this meeting, which I, I tried to do my job, but all the uh, the work, I think uh, the uh, scientific committee has a lot of work, but the scientific committee has uh, some work which is, uh, in my case, I think is easier for <laughs> in, in organizing a, a large meeting. The organizing committee has a, an easier job. The, the main job is for those who are in the local committee. They have uh, really the heavy job in a, an organization like this. So uh, my special thanks to Maria José Pacifico and uh, to Imp as well, who um, is now uh, hosting, uh, hosting us here. And um, I, I'd like also to thank SBM for the, uh, that, that uh, did all this uh, part of... Um, SBM was uh, the society who provided all the, uh, how do you say, um, this part of the organization for, um, for, for the organization for, for this meeting. So I'd like to thank you all and welcome you all and hope this will be, oh, I, I just don't hope. I'm sure this is a successful meeting right now. Okay, thank you. Okay, good night. <clears throat> First of all, I want to thank all the participants to this joint meeting for coming to this beautiful location to enjoy this week of mathematics. So we all know that uh, nowadays, more than ever, mathematics is present in the day life of the great majority of human beings, even more than what we are conscious about. But mathematics is also a formidable cultural phenomenon probably the oldest scientific activity of human beings. It is a great vehicle 
of universal communication, of collaboration and friendship among people and civilizations. It is in this spirit that we organized this event. The links between mathematical communities of Brazil and Italy are solid and not new. Let me remember, as an algebraic geometer, that Giacomo Albanese, a student of Francesco Severi, moved to Brazil from Italy in the 30s, and the library he enriched in Sao Paulo with classical books of algebraic geometry was there when first Zariski and later Weil spent some years in Sao Paulo. They both acknowledged Albanese for having made the library so useful and interesting. In more recent times, several Italian mathematicians visited Brazil, established collaboration with Brazilian colleagues. Some of them got permanent positions here. There is therefore no doubt that the relationship between our communities are going to increase, and this is an occasion to improve the existing ones and to create new ones. So we are here to celebrate mathematics, Brazil and Italy, and their increasing friendship. Let me finish by thanking a number of institution, institutions and people. Well, first of all, the uh, um, scientific, uh, the scientific uh, communities uh, which organized this uh, society have been already recalled. Particular thanks go to IMPA for the hospitality. And let me thank the Italian Institute of Alta Mathematica, Francesco Severi, which supported a number of Italian participants. Uh, the Italian consulate in Rio, I'm particularly grateful to the consul, the scientific committee, which I had the honor of chair or co-chair with my old, old means from since a long time, old friend, uh, uh, well, <laughs> I don't see miss. Uh, the session organizers and speakers, the main speakers for having accepted to come, and to make this, uh, this uh, event so important. Of course, all participants, and last but not least, the organizing committee, and in particular, Zese. She has been doing a lot, let, let me really, I know what she has been doing. She has been doing really a lot of work with um, a great amount of patience, by the way. So we, <laughs> at least for me, I mean, I was far away, so. <laughs> she could have been <laughs> much less impatient. Okay, so thank you for, uh, for the hospitality, for the work you have been doing, and please enjoy this beautiful week. Well, good evening. Uh, Italy has a long tradition of uh, being uh, open to scientific collaboration. Uh, many of us here have the experience of uh, visiting uh, the International Center for Theoretical Physics, uh, where there is a uh, uh, half of it, or almost half of it, is dedicated to mathematics. At the same, same time, Italy uh, has a special care for uh, science in developing countries, not only through ICTP that I have mentioned, but also through the Academy of Science for the Developing World, uh, to us. So this uh, mechanism uh, in the past facilitated a lot uh, the cooperation between uh, scientists from Brazil and uh, especially mathematics and perhaps physics and uh, the Italian uh, communities. So it's great to see this uh, joint meeting in mathematics now taking place. 
and I am sure it will be a success. Thank you. I decline in favor of Chiro. <laughs> so I will pass the uh, microphone to Zese. Okay. Well, first of all, thank a lot for your nice words about my work. But anyhow, um, potrei parlare in italiano ma o portoghese. Ma this is an event uh, and widely open to talented mathematicians, collaborators, and uh, with the Italian and Brazilian communities. And so I'm going to use English as the official language of the meeting. Okay? Okay. Um, you know that I, I, I am or I was, I think that from now on now I was the chair organized from the <laughs> organizing committee, of the local organizing committee. And uh, I will uh, speak uh, small words about this from this point of view. And so indeed uh, I was completely unaware of the complexity of organ in organizing a meeting as big as this one when I accepted this task. Indeed. Otherwise, I think that I would not accept it. Huh? <laughs> but now that most of the things are done, I'm confident that uh, it will be a nice meeting. And during this week, we are going to have many opportunities of interchange and experience and knowledge. Now I have a list of uh, acknowledgements for people and the uh, entities that made this meeting possible. I would like to thank the Sociedade Brasileira de Matemática, the Unione Matemática Italiana, a Sociedade Brasileira de Matemática Aplicada e Computacional, e a uh, end the Società Italiana di Matematica Applicata, Applicata Industriali to promote this meeting. Uh, I would like to thank the Scientific Committee for its great work on selecting and analyzing the special and the sections and the plenary talks, and um, to the organizers of all the 27 sections in this meeting. I would like to also to thank the local organizing committee, which gave their disponibility in organizing the event. And uh, I would like to thank Cesar Camacho, the ex-director of IMPA, that during the, his mandate gave the disponibility of the facilities of IMPA and to especially also to Marcelo Viana, the present director of WIMPA, that he knew this support. The support of WIMPA has been fundamental in many events and also for this one. Without uh, this support and uh, the personal involvement of Marcelo, this event would have been much more difficult to realize. We thank the funding agencies, um, our Brazilian funding agencies, CAPES, CNPq, and uh, FAPERSI, that are our funding agencies for their financial support, although due the, to the difficulties of Rio de Janeiro State, the FAPERSI support is still virtual. And I would like to thank Walter Moreira and Marcelo Monteiro, from my university, the Federal University of Rio de Janeiro, for their help in the production, production of the graphic material for this meeting. And uh, I am a particular thankful to Luis Manuel, the webmaster, for his patience in dealing with my feeding <laughs> the content of the website. And uh, also thankful to Leticia Ribas and uh, Renata Maiato for their help in the final organization of the meeting. Uh, I am sure that besides all the work we had, I will miss you 
next uh, month, especially the organizers, that I will feel saudade of all your daily emails. <laughs> <laughs> and also, um, I take this opportunity to invite you to the first uh, International Mathematical Congress in Latin America that will be held in Rio de Janeiro in August 2018. And Marcello already and the, is the one of the main organizers. And uh, to the other meetings announced by Marcelo, Marcelo before. Okay? And uh, Okay, and uh, just on a sad note, I would like to propose a, a minute of silence to honor the two, almost 300 victims of the earthquake last week on Italy. Welcome to all of you and enjoy this city, the Cidade Chita Maravilhosa, Maravilhosa, Cidade Maravilhosa, and profit for all facilities and the beauty of the city during this week. And also, IMPA, that is, you will have the opportunity, to, the ones who is here for the first time, to, to see how important is this institution to all of us here, not only in Rio de Janeiro, but for the whole uh, mathematical community here in Brazil. Okay, and then now, please, I invite you to hear in a few minutes, Turibio Santos will present a recital, a guitar recital, okay? So the, the rest will start within very few minutes. I ask you not to leave, and uh, and then afterwards there will be a cocktail outside. So whoever leaves won't get entrance to the cocktail. 